is up YouTube, welcome back, welcome back to all of you, thank you for joining me yet again on, well, a sad day, um, it's the day after I heard the sad news of the loss of Diego Maradona, Diego Armando Maradona, the the god in Napoli, you know, it, it, for many teams, for the, the world of football, not just Napoli and all the teams he played, but he lit up the world like, on the pitch. And we all know the hand of God moment, but we also, a lot of people forget the other goal he scored against England. And, could, you know, of course, people sadly remember the hand of God uh, too much, like, uh, more than they should really, because the amount of amazing things he did in his career and the, the amount of players that formed their style of play based on him that we see today and a big connection to Tottenham Hotspur to my beloved club because of Ozzy Ardiles and that famous testimonial where Maradona played in a Spurs shirt uh, alongside people like Glenn Hoddle and Ozzy Ardiles of course and my dad and my uncle were lucky enough to be there all those years ago and so the Maradona story is like really runs deep you know and the fact that he played in Italy and made Napoli a force to be reckoned with in Italy, in Italian football where the North dominated. Um, he just wiped the floor with all of them. And I really doubt Messi could have ever done that at Napoli. Um, but yeah, Maradona is like Jesus to those people. And you see why, what he did for that club. You know, all our, whatever club you support, there's your, your legends, your, the legends that you look up to in your team, in the club you idolise, and, you know, for Napolitans, he's just, he's more than a player. It's more than what you see on the pitch. It's everything, you know? And, yeah, he, he just lit up the pitch. And, funnily enough, the other day I was watching a series all about the, like, the Argentinian league, and, like, Boca Juniors, where he was, you know, uh, where he dominated and he was amazing. He started over there and then towards the end of his career went back and was still amazing. Um, we know as a coach, but Maradona is just, he's more than a player. And it's just really sad. He was 60 and far too young, you know. Um, you've got legends in football, him being the, the, the top of the list, you know. Pele being another one, uh, still with us, thankfully, you know. Uh, but yeah, it's been a year we've lost, like, not just for great football players and sportsmen, but like, you know, so many actors. Sean Connery, um, that I didn't get to do a video about, but that was very sad. A legend, you know, James Bond, uh, so many other films over the years. A uh, brilliant actor, but yeah, this year has just been. You know, difficult, you know, Kobe, of course, another another person on the same level of, like, talent as Maradona, you know, on, in that same uh, bracket of amazing players that did more than light up the pitch and were more than players in their sports, whatever clubs they were at, you know. Um, but yes, yeah, it's just a sad, sad day for the world, for football, for sports. But here we are, guys. I'm in my garden, freezing my nuts off. Because <laughs> it's blooming winter now, isn't it? You know? I just want to be summer. Like, I want to flip, flip my fingers, or flip a switch, and it's just a good 27 degrees, and I'm out here in a t-shirt. Instead, I've got my, my, my denim jacket on, which is actually quite warm, but I'm still freezing. Um, but yeah, thank you for joining me. R.I.P. Diego Maradona. Legend. Take it easy, guys, and I'll see you on my next video. Stay up, stay humble, guys. Stay passionate in whatever it is you do. And yeah, that is it from me for now. Peace. Call me